Welcome back, beautiful tri-state area. You're listening to a moment of Zen right here on 710 WOR, the voice of New York, iHeartRadio. I'm your host, Zen Sams. Up in just a few minutes in our Going Deep segment brought to you by CO2 Lift. Today, I'm joined by the awesome Savannah Boda, a licensed medical esthetician and acne specialist based in Dallas, Texas, with a cult following of over a quarter million on Instagram. Savannah is the founder and owner of Savannah Boda Aesthetics, which is a medical spa that focuses on ethically driven aesthetic results. She's a beauty influencer who goes by the handle at the Dallas Esthetician. She's an ambassador for skin pen and face reality, Bio Real Peel and Bio Juve. That's just to name a few. You can listen to her on her podcast, The Blondest, where she talks about skincare, business, motherhood, and everything in between. Today, she joins me to chat carboxytherapy and why carboxytherapy is part of the bigger picture of something called combo therapy and why no single solo method is an effective approach to skincare. A one-size-fits-all approach, whether it's for anti-aging treatments or body contouring treatments, is no longer the norm. Most clients often want to correct the combination of concerns ranging from wrinkles, saggy skin, and unwanted fat, to sunspots, veins, and hollows from lost collagen. No one treatment can provide a client with a solution for multiple concerns. So for example, a dermal filler is an excellent, excellent solution for treating volume loss, but it's not going to improve the, the appearance of sunspots. Kybella, for instance, will reduce unwanted chin fat, but it's not going to improve sagging skin. So what is there to do? Well, since utilizing only one mode of treatment may not address all signs of aging, the solution is combination therapy. And this approach makes the possibilities basically endless and the results dramatic. And the combination of treatment can be customized to address your specific concerns. Don't take it from me. Take it from the expert at hand. Welcoming now to the show is my beauty expert, Savannah Voda. Welcome to the show, Stunner. How are you guys? I'm excited to be here. So, so excited to have you on, Savannah. So you are an advisory board member of the National Aesthetic Spa Network and an in-house esthetician for Dermascope magazine. Many value you, and they should, as an educator in skincare. So when you're not working with clients, I, I'm, to my understanding, you're speaking at trade shows and mentoring other estheticians. Your passion is clearly educating others on skincare, whether it's, it's in clinic or social media or at conferences. What did being voted 2023 Esthetician of the Year mean to your career? Um, it was amazing. I truly just never expected to be named that. And honestly, it's been such a long journey in the industry. And I just really am glad that estheticians are now being able to be recognized and get that platform. Because for the longest time, you know, dermatologists were the go-to for everything skin needs. And I think estheticians now are really the forefront of the industry and in showing that we can work together um, as a unit. And it's not just like the dermatologists versus the estheticians that we really all can come together and give those clients the best experience and treatments possible. And you're doing exactly that, paving the way. You've gone where there was no path and are leaving a great big trail, my dear. And now technology and innovation are contributing to the evolution of combo therapy, what we call in the skin industry. And being up to date with the latest advancements is critical. And I know you're always up to date. So carboxytherapy is a treatment that's been around since the 1930s, though the method of delivery has in fact improved since then with a gel delivery system called CO2 Lift. Savannah, what are some examples of skincare treatments or procedures that are commonly combined in what we call combo therapy and what benefits do they offer over single methods? So yeah, I like to use my carboxy therapy with literally everything. Yesterday actually was the first day we've had every single client. I do about 13 clients a day that have done the CO2 lift mask. They wanted to add it on because what it's going to do is just help enhance those results, increase the skin's hydration, help reduce redness and downtime. So combo therapy, I like to do it with lasers, microneedling, even after chemical peels. Um, it's just really makes such a big difference in the aftercare. And I think that's the biggest thing. A lot of people are so concerned about downtime, um, especially with social media. Even if you work from home, you have to be on Zoom. You have to see people still. So it's really, really important for patients to have that downtime cut in half. Um, so that's really how I've been util utilizing the carboxy therapy in my clinic. And 
and really helping enhance those procedures and results. And I also stack so many other modalities. I'll do microneedling with lasers. Um, dermaplaning can be added on to pretty much any procedure that you do in the beauty space. So there are so many things that can just maximize your results. I like to call it treatment stacking. Um, so there are times where I'll, try, I'll stack gosh, three different modalities in one treatment and clients are just getting the most bang for their buck and um, loving those results. And that's why you were voted esthetician of the year because you know your stuff. And when we talk about medical monotherapies, CO2 Lift Pro is a very, very effective. It's great for a severely dry skin or itchy skin uh, for the speedy recovery and healing of wounds. It, it also increases blood flow. So that's a great added value to that um, CO2 Lift Carboxy therapy. But it's also great as an aesthetic, to your point, as a, an aesthetic monotherapy. So for those fine lines and wrinkles, the creepy skin, the dark circles, the inflamed skin, uh, the textural imbalances, the enlarged pores. That's what, for me, it was the enlarged pores. What a game changer this product was. Now, how does CO2 Lift Savannah matter and fit into the roadmap of a procedure? And why does healthy skin respond better? So when your skin is healthy, it's going to receive the treatments better. It's going to perform better. It's going to heal better. So I always like to say it's basically like if you're taking care of your body, right, and you're eating healthy, and then you go work out, you're going to see better results. Same thing. If you start with healthy skin and then you go do that procedure like working out, you're just going to get a better outcome. So truly prepping that skin, priming that skin, and having a healthy barrier before you're doing these procedures is going to enhance your results, make your downtime so much less, and just help that skin heal better. So for me, I like to use this. You can prep with the patient. Like if they're numbing, they can actually do it on top of numbing cream um, just to really help hydrate that skin whenever you're about to do an ablative laser or if you're about to do microneedling. It just literally you can see the skin respond so much better. And then you can do it again. That's the best thing. You can do it literally before you do your treatment. You can do it right after you do your treatment and you can do it at home while you're recovering from your procedure. So it's just really optimizing that skin's hydration, oxygen into the skin, and really helping that waste removal process. You're right. Carboxy therapy from the reviews and the peer reviews I've read is a favorite practitioner go-to treatment to reverse damage, accelerate healing, and keep patient's skin very healthy. You're spot on. Now, in your experience, what are the key considerations when combining medical aesthetic treatments and traditional skincare practices for optimal results? Yeah, combining the two is super important because you're going to be able to optimize those results and you want to make sure that you're also taking care of the skin inside and out, right? So we want to make sure that we're starting with healthy skin before we're doing more ablative and medical procedures. And when you're using things like carboxy therapy, all you're going to do is truly just enhance. There's no contraindications. You can use it on anyone. I mean, my son, he got a really bad cut on his face. We use it on him. I mean, you can use it on truly any and everybody. Um, so many will use it after surgeries as well, which is another amazing point to help with that scar revision and helping um, really with the tissue of the scarring. And there's just so many ways that you can use this procedure and this product at home and clinic. I mean, it's just so versatile. Without a doubt, it's uh, it's definitely very versatile. Now, the CO2 Lift Pro, if you look at their, their um, uh, product line, is the strongest version of carboxy gel. Uh, and it's an in-office or at at home treatment that delivers the CO2 cutaneously over 45 minutes to an hour, but it's a transdermal non-invasive facial mask. For those of you listening and wondering what the application here is, really it's it, the base of this product is a face facial mask and it's recommended for post-procedure care after invasive procedures such as needling or laser, but then they also have the vaginal rejuvenation treatment. And of course, if you can use this on diabetic ulcers and open wounds, then you better, you know, you, you, you better feel comfortable enough that it's going to be great for your face. Now, Savannah, as someone with a substantial following on Instagram and a podcast, how do you use your social media and content creation to educate and engage your audience on skincare topics. Yeah, so skincare is a part of my day-to-day -day life. I do, you know, my skincare every morning and night. So I really just combine it with my social media. So if I'm about to wash my face, I'm going to film it. If I'm about to do a treatment on myself, I film it so that I can share that knowledge and share how I do it. Because I think the biggest thing for people is they want to see it in real time. Like, how are you doing this? A lot of people just post a picture of a product 
and you know write all the information about it and that's great but i think for a lot of people they're visual learners and once they can see a professional applying a product the correct way how many pumps to use how to apply it all of the just inner workings of that treatment it just makes it more tangible and easier for them to feel less intimidated to attempt to do it at home especially when it's something that is able to be done by yourself at home like carboxy therapy with the co2 pro lift mask you are so on it. Now we've gotten through all the heavy lifting. Let's chat your personal favorite. So the holiday season is here. We are going to be traveling, whether we're traveling for family or whether we're traveling for business, whether we're traveling solo or with kids in tow. What is your top three go-to absolute must-haves that you're going to travel with product-wise? Definitely my CO2 lift mask because it's just going to make you look so good for the holidays. It's going to help increase that skin's hydration, smooth those fine lines and wrinkles. I mean, it is just a pick me up and you can do it every week for three weeks for best results. But I do mine more than once a week because I just love the way it makes my skin feel. I would say my second favorite would have to be the Hyacin Active Spray. It's a hypochlorous acid spray that helps kill bad bacteria. So really great for when you're traveling and just trying to refresh your skin skin um, at the airport or the airplane to get that bacteria away and great for toddlers if they get any scratches or cuts. I always say I wish my parents had this back in the day instead of pouring hydrogen peroxide all over my cuts and wounds because this doesn't burn. It's as strong as bleach but as gentle as water. And then my number three I would have to say would be an eye cream especially during the holidays working long hours trying to make everyone else beautiful. Um, I definitely get those dark circles. So an eye cream is my go-to and my favorite would be the Interfuse eye from skin better boom look at you you're just like the encyclopedia here of skincare we are out of time i want to thank you so much for coming on your knowledge is so well received and i love chatting with you because hey we all know enough to know that we don't know everything we, we rely on experts like you to teach us the best ways to go about caring for our skin and making sure that we're looking fabulous and radiant so thank you so much savannah thank you it was amazing thank you guys so much that was Savannah Boda, a licensed medical esthetician and acne specialist based in Dallas, Texas. You could head directly to her website at savannahboda.com or you could check her out on the gram at the Dallas Esthetician. That was our Going Deep segment brought to you by CO2 Lift. You're listening to A Moment of Zen right here on 710 WOR, the voice of New York iHeartRadio. We'll be right back after this. A Moment of Zen is brought to you by CO2 Lift. As we age, our skin loses moisture and elasticity causing wrinkled skin. You can reverse this aging process with CO2 Lift. CO2 Lift utilizes the powerful benefits of carbon dioxide to lift, tighten, and regenerate your skin. This simple, painless at home carboxy therapy treatment is scientifically proven to reverse the aging process. You will see reduction in wrinkles, increase in luminosity, and improve pigmentation, sagging, skin tone, and radiance. For more information or to order CO2 Lift, go to CO2Lift.com.